Hey everyone, welcome to Walks with Holly. In case you're joining me for the first time, I am Holly and I am a housewife, mom of four kids, and a homeschooling mom. And I do a lot of homeschooling, lifestyle, mommy, and cooking videos. So if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscribe button right now and help my channel grow. Today's video, I am going to be making again another favorite of ours, and that is cranberry chicken in the crock pot. I know there are a lot of cranberry chicken recipes out there. Believe me, I have tried a lot of different ways of making it. And you know, some aren't very good, but I have found one that is fantastic. I discovered this one probably about six months ago, and ever since then, I have been making it at least once a month. Let's get into cranberry chicken in the crock pot. Here's the ingredients that I'll be using. Whole cranberry sauce, ketchup, orange juice, onion powder, cayenne pepper, black pepper, parsley flakes, and chicken breast and chicken thighs, both boneless and skinless. So I'm gonna mix together all my stuff here. I'm gonna be doing one teaspoon onion powder, half a teaspoon of black pepper, half a teaspoon of parsley flakes, and a half a teaspoon of cayenne pepper. And I'll just mix together my spices, and then I'm gonna add one and a half cup of ketchup, and just scrape all that out and get all that in there. And then I'm gonna be adding two cans of whole cranberry sauce, 14 ounces each. And then I'm going to add two tablespoons of orange juice. And then I'm just gonna give everything a good mix. Mix in the spices with the liquids. Then I'll go ahead and add my chicken to the crock pot. And as you can see, I'm using frozen chicken. I'm going to be doing four chicken breasts and four chicken thighs, both boneless and skinless. And then we'll go ahead and dump all the mixture on top of the chicken. And I'll turn the crock pot on low and let this cook on low for seven to eight hours. And after seven to eight hours is up, you'll see that your chicken is fully cooked in the delicious cranberry mixture. So I'll go ahead and transfer my chicken to a serving dish and I like to shred it up, not that much, just lightly shred. And then I'm gonna just add my mixture and I like to strain out the mixture to get the big chunks out because I actually will not be using all the sauce all at once, but I like to get the nice big chunks on there. But that is it, that is the simple but delicious cranberry chicken. And as you can see, it is just tender and juicy and oh, I just love the flavor of it. So we like to serve it with rice and steamed broccoli. And yeah, it's just one of our favorite meals. And if you wanna try making this recipe for yourself, the recipe will be in the description box below. All right, that was cranberry chicken in the crock pot. And if you have any questions about it, please put your questions in the comments below or just write me a nice comment. Let me know if you made it for yourself. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. It would really help my channel and help me to grow so I can make more videos in the future. Again, I appreciate you watching today's video. I hope to see you next time on Walks with Holly.